Um, my family still has COVID. I'm over COVID, thankfully. But while they have it, um, my convulsive seizures were pretty bad. And I don't know if y'all have ever... I don't know who out there is on their own and is independent. Creds to you. Legitimate. Like... I'm... I don't know what it's like to be able to be self, self, um, supportive and can do everything by yourself. I don't know. Because I've always, I've always had help. So, um, when it came, when my family got really sick and it came to me, like, having to get through seizures by myself that was really hard and something i'm not used to and so i fell in my room and i just laid there i didn't completely black out my vision was gone but i was still aware does that make sense so i'm not sure if you'd consider that like a blackout um, but I was like convulsing and I couldn't see, but I was aware, um, and then I just laid there and my head hurt, um, and yeah, I broke down and I cried, not because emotionally I was not okay, but because it daggum hurt, okay? So, um... There were several instances like that, and it just made me really, really thankful for um, all the times my family has always been there for me. And um, I just wanted to thank the parents of the, if you have a child or a sibling, if you know someone with epilepsy and you've been there for them emotionally, physically, like whatever you've been able to do for that person, thank you you're making a difference in this world um even though you may feel like no i'm not 